well, this is old Total Warrior, and this is the beginning of a new campaign as the rebels and slaves. There are no victory conditions specified them since, for them since it's not considered to be an actual playable faction. So I'm just going to go for the Imperial victory conditions of capturing 50 regions including Rome and I expect to stop at that time and declare victory. The rebels are a very interesting um, faction to play with. They have uh, unique difficulties and are generally considered to be far harder than any of the other factions. Let's look at what we have in the way of towns. We have actually 30 towns the problem is most of them are just placeholders. They just have some people and that's about it. Many of them don't even have a governor's house built. They're just places on the map. We also have the issue that the finances are not very good. Uh, we have a starting treasury of 10,000 but we start out losing money because there there is a substantial army. The, the first problem is that Terra is the capital and that's in the corner of the map and that's a very very bad place. So the first thing to do here is move the capital to Sloan. It probably won't stay here. But that's a much better place for it. And just by doing that we've improved the finances to making 2000. Uh, so we've, we've added 6,000 to our revenue simply by moving the capital and reducing corruption everywhere. Uh, but there's more we can do. We have a lot of cities, a lot of towns that are just really indefensible. And so I want to start disbanding uh, some warbands. Warbands have a high upkeep, 200 denarii a turn. I'll, I'll keep the druids here. They're, they're cheap. They're only 90 a turn and they can hold off a siege as well as a bunch of units uh, in what is anyway in, in an impossible situation. Here I'm going to move these war bands and, and cavalry from Lugdunum and then I'll disband the war bands. I'm going to try to hold Lugdunum. War band and Pesdin Segesta should be familiar with those from any Rome, any Julii campaign and I'll move those and I'll disband those on the second turn. Apollonia attacked by the Brutii very quickly. We'll get our troops out of there and we'll move them up here to protect Salona. Heading back to the north. Indefensible. Let's save some more money. Pika's Gothi again indefensible. Let's move out of there towards here. I want to move those two war bands down to here. Try to create a little army in that region. These are the Amazon chariots, the archer chariots. They're very, very good. And I want to move them down here. This is going to take quite a while. Siki, I'm going to abandon that. Imperator. Try to form an army in Aquincom. Same thing with these guys. Move Use that as a core of an army. Segesta, we'll leave Segestica, I mean, we'll leave alone. Salona. Uh, I'll leave alone for now. Athens, try to hold on to Athens, try to hold on to Byzantium, uh, try to hold on to Chersonesos. Over here we have Fraspa, can't hold on to that. So we'll just ban these guys. Saves another 300 denarii. I want to try to save those archers. We might be able to sneak them through and get them into my territory eventually. I like archers. I hate to just give them up without trying. A couple more units here in Dumatha. We can't defend them from the Parthians, so let's 
move them here to Bostra. That's where we have a little bit of a defense there as a wall. The Egyptians will attack it, but uh, they usually attack with a small army. I'll try to hang on to it. This army, we're going to move north. We're going to join in this army that's in Palmyra, which is going to attack Damascus. city has a general garrison and some other troops so I want to fight them in the open and hopefully kill the general uh, with archers. Should be easier than trying to uh, take him down on his town square. Nice army here. I think this is actually my best army. And we're going to go up here and lay siege to Sardis. Try to take it on turn two. Let's bring that cavalry back here. There's a Greek city here I want to take. Yeah, some more hoplites. Over here in North Africa. I'm going to abandon Nepte. to Lepsis Magna. I have a good chance at keeping this. So I will I will try to do that. Let's go through the cities. Uh, I have to crank up the taxes on all of them. I don't have to, uh, I should say, but there's no real harm public order because these are rebel cities so public order doesn't matter they've already rebelled you can't rebel from being rebels and we need lots of money these first few turns because the cities are so poor we don't really have a very good economy so we have to build it up from almost nothing so just take a minute here once I've done that I'll go through do some constructing, recruit a couple units, and then we'll be done with the first turn. One of the problems with the rebels is because there are so many and they're so widely scattered that you can't defend them all and that's why I'm basically abandoning the ones in essentially Northwest Europe. If you try to hold them, it's worse because then you, you have your resources scattered out and, and you lose everywhere. You can't defend everywhere. So the idea is to create a core empire. And I'll show you on the map here in a second what that is going to be. And then expand from the core, uh, understanding that I'm going to lose some cities while trying to gain new cities. But the cities I gain uh, will be better than the cities I lose. At least that's the plan. There. Now we're going to put the cities in population order and go to spend money. I'll build a port here. Recruit Byzantium. I think this is a pretty good port. 127, yeah. Terra, do nothing there. Themyscira, build the road there. Massilia. Actually, I want to start the barracks there so that I can start recruiting troops. So 
has to go nothing. Land clearance. I can't afford to start the mines this turn, so I'll start the mines later when I have uh, more things going. Lugginum, nothing. Cherisnesis. Barracks. Land clearance. Myra. Land clearance. Land clearance. Land clearance. Borders hold nothing. Kydonia. Start the city. Apollonia nothing. Nicomedia. Start the city. As you can see your Luva room won't bother with Segesta. Yes. Austria. Yes. I can come. Yes. Because Gotham. No. Expect to lose it. Not to spend any money on it. Trying to hang on to that. For Asper, No. That. Yes. That. Yes. Lulaziki. No. Okay, and I'm out of money, so I, and I've got a, a few cities I can't start yet. Salona and Ankara, they'll have to wait to the second turn. So that is the first turn. Didn't take any time at all, let's do a save. Very hard, very hard. Let's call this 3 1. On to the second turn. And the enemy have sallied forth. The main problem is the general. The other people I can evade, the pelt tests I can overrun. Let's try to take Damascus. In addition to problems with the cities, the rebels have the problem that if they lose a battle, they lose all their troops. It's just like when you're playing in the regular game as a regular faction, and you beat the rebels, they lose everything. Well, when you're playing as the rebels and you lose, you lose everything. Also, the rebels don't have any generals, and so they're at the mercy of the game, the AI. What's coming out first? And providing them with generals. Although they can get generals later by eliminating factions. The any leftover generals uh, become rebel generals just as uh, they do in the, the game when you're playing as some other uh, real faction. Should speed this up. I want to go quite that close to that tower. I think the general has come out on the north side there. It's a really good location for a city. Not a good location if you're trying to attack it, unless you come in from that other direction from the mountains. Unfortunately, uh, we didn't. sort of thing I was afraid of. The 
enemy general is running away. This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it's beyond belief. I want him running away, I want him dead. Send those horse archers after him. These guys take the town. So I'll have to kill the general. Or just one. Killed one of his guys. Maybe not. They're just going to be able to buy them. Because they're not fighting. Okay, get in there. Somebody is routed. Down to the town square. The walls are no longer ours. The enemy have taken them. Is in flight. Pre That'll do. This is a heroic victory worthy of Roman arms. We lost quite a few guys, including a lot of archers, but we did take the city. It was, I did not expect that to be an easy battle. But it wouldn't have been easy doing it the other way either. It's going to occupy it. It isn't very large. And enslaving it is going to put uh, people in the cities that I'm going to lose. And extermination hurts the uh, income. Essentially for the rest of the game, because you never recover that in exchange for a little bit of money. Okay, we'll be starting out with 8,000. some building done which of course means more building this turn. Okay, I have to restart the game right after the auto save uh, because I had a bug show up and uh, well that's just the way it goes sometimes. These Judean Zalots uh, showed up as additional mercenaries or additional rebels. Attack! Victory! Orders? So we'll use them Onward! to help with this. Imperator. Hold it off here. Imperator. Sir! Make sure Sir! everybody can get to the right uh, right square. Leaving the army. Forward! There. Settlement, sir. Settlement under siege, sir. Orders move out. There, excellent. Orders forward. Prepare for battle. 
those should be easy to brush aside. Now I want to take this towel. Sardis. This is about four units. So in general, a couple hoplites and a peasant, I think. The real concern is the general. Yes, he can generals wreak havoc as anyone who's played this game knows. This morning, an eagle circled the camp three times, then flew towards the rising sun. Such hey, good for him. Units. You don't want those guys Units. pushing rams. Rub equipment. Units. Rub the unslinger. Forward. Hoplites. Target formation. Hang on the ram. Hoplites. Use the hoplites. Just have to remember to put them back in uh, Phalanx formation when they're done. God's you guys get up here. The reinforcements are here. And Send them to fight. Dishearten the enemy. Up. So what do we got? Militia hoplites, peasants, uh, a general. Hard to tell. I think that's another set of hoplites down into town square. Sound a little, I bet I sound hoarse. I feel a little bit hoarse right now. So I think I'll just do these two turns and quit. Our soldiers are at the walls! Shoot now the peasants they must up. Our way through. Shoot up the hoplites. Our soldiers have done their work well! The battering ram is... The gods have smiled on us today. The walls are broken. Our troops should be ordered forward. You yeah, the general took a pass. Okay. Good form to back up. Get the archers in there. Our soldiers have captured the walls. Now is the time up. to press on and capture this place. What do we kill? 65%. Somebody came back to die. The last of the uh, uh, I don't think I want to need you for anything, but better to have you and not need you than need you and not have you. Stop just shooting, shooting our own troops. So I'm 13.
lads have filled the heart of the enemy general with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. Up light. Up light. Not a brave display. Say the general's still alive, he's out there uh, running in circles. When he must have got uh, a little bit close to a tower. Now we have another city. Victory! Rome has conquered! It's not very big, we'll just occupy it. Turn. Yes, good. Onward. Orders. That will be okay. Should be a lot there. Just three units. Orders. Try to move him a little bit more. Onward. Forward. Orders. Move them over here. Onward. Out of move, sir. Spend those. Imperator. Get him in the Onward. town. Not a very useful wonder in this particular campaign. Orders. Do a quick Orders. click around, make sure Orders. I've covered everything. General. Uh -huh. That's the Okay, now towns. 
want to do this in population because there were some of the smaller ones I didn't get to. And I want to get those started in FD, don't want to bother with. You I did start the method, I don't want to bother with. You I did start, I think it's Solana. Right, Solana. That one. Sardis raise taxes. And a hoplite. Raise taxes. Just recruit a peasant there. These guys are pretty worthless. Try to get those mines started. Okay, Cyrene. Oh. So Thirty four hundred. Or is a Coedonia? Need clearance. Media. Need clearance. I'm starting uh, Palisade there. Land clearance ahead of other things in some of those cities. I don't expect them to be attacked. This, however, might get attacked fairly soon. It's not likely. Uh, that's another city that might get attacked fairly soon. Don't worry about that. Nothing to do in Acre. Lovasiki, Solana. the end of turn two. I think this would be a good place to stop. So thanks for watching. Post any questions or comments on YouTube. But aha, I thought of something. I should check on the capital. The capital is at Salona. Finances say 9073. Let's check on moving it to uh, here. Two six nine. What about Athens? Or not Athens? Is it 
clicking the wrong thing. Nine eight two one. See, it, it is moving already. Because I, I picked up those two cities. That was nine eight two one. Let's move it here. Nine five eight eight. So moving it to Athens on turn two. All right. Glad I thought of that. So once again, thank you for watching. Post any questions or comments on YouTube.